Alrighty, hello and welcome back. Um, I'm gonna attempt to record this right now. Um, I have a video I'm trying to re-upload that didn't get fully uploaded last night. Something happened and it stopped, so... I have a secondary vid video of it uploading. So if the recording is wonky, I apologize. We are going to go right to the end here. I haven't played this franchise in... I don't know, since... Jeez, I don't even know. It's been a while. It's been a while. Over a month, for sure. I wanted to say, like, oh, I haven't played this franchise since, like, June, but <laughs> that's a lie. This game only came out three months ago. <laughs> I'm not sure how much longer I'm going to go with this franchise. Um... I'll probably keep it, maybe come back to it at some point, but mm, I think I just might roll it out a couple more, do it the same format I've been doing uh, my alumni franchises. Um, I'm just going to sim out the entire season all at once, call it good. It's taking forever to sim, holy cow. Any day now, buds.
All right, looks like uh, they did pretty good for points. Two guys were more than a point per game. Okay. Good job. Look at that. Oh, wait, no, that's not who I'm thinking it is. <laughs> I was thinking that was Soup Man. I forgot he's not in this franchise. Oh, yeah, yeah. Such a dumb dumb. I think that's the same name. I think that's what screwed me up. Like, it's it's pretty close. It's like, it, it's Mikhaev instead of Mikhaev. Something like that. <laughs> but yeah, that, that screwed me up a bit. Hey, we won the President's Trophy. Alright, let's see if the Colorado Kool-Aid kicks our butt. As it stands on my channel right now, if anyone has actually made it to this point in the video, I've noticed my average view durations aren't really all that high on anything but franchise mode, honestly. And even on franchise mode, it's like maybe 10, 10 minutes, something like that. Um, the franchise and hot packs are the two things that are keeping my channel afloat. I wish I had more engagement on my channel. Partially that is my fault. I don't push any of it. I, that's not who I am. It's not who I want to be. I don't want to be one of those guys every video. Oh, like and subscribe and comment down below what you think about this. I honestly... There's a few YouTubers I watch on a daily basis that are bigger than me, obviously. Way bigger than me. Of course, I don't take much. Anyways, um, they say that every, they'll, you know, I mean, I know that's the way to do it. Pose a question, ask for a response. And, you know, even if a hundred people watch it, there's probably going to be two or three that actually respond to it at least. So, I mean, if I did start doing that, I would get more responses. However, that's just, that's that's not me, honestly. That drives me nuts. Usually, whenever I get to that section of a video, it's, like, there's one guy in particular. It's usually the last minute and a half. It's all that kind of posing questions. And once it gets to that point, I usually just close out of the video. Because it's like I can recite what he's going to say without him even saying it and there can be different topics and I still know exactly what he's gonna say okay so we are in the conference finals I am so stuffed up it is not even funny I'm feeling good though I'm feeling better um what they were really I don't know if I should talk about uh, what the hell. I went through a really rough patch lately in my personal life. And went and got put back on some medication. The first time I've been on any kind of medication. Well, I mean besides antibiotics when I'm sick and whatnot. But this is the first time I've been on medication in over 10 years. I'm only about a week into it now, a little less than a week, like four days, but I'm already starting to feel better, um, and I needed it, trust me, boy did I need it, I was, I was 1700 pounds of C4 waiting to go off, I was... I mean, I'm, I'm not a really big guy, per se. Like, I'm like... At one point, I was 6'1", but due to all my back injuries, I've actually lost some height, and I'm only 6' tall now. But I'm not that big. Like, I'm a buck 75, maybe. 
on a good day, on a day where I eat a lot of McDonald's, maybe a buck seventy-five. Of course, I want to be in Seattle. Oh, good, we won the cup. All right. Anyways, that is how my life has been going recently. I had one thing after another after another pile up, and it, uh, it, it, what's the word I'm looking for? It culminated on a day I was having a very rough day, and then my truck broke down on me on the way home. And I lost it. And that next, that day, I called to make an appointment. That next day, I went to the doctor and got put on medicine. Because I seen how I got. And I knew if I didn't do something, I was going to snap for sure. But, alrighty, we are at the end of this video. I'm going to quit ranting about my personal life. I'm surprised I'm even talking about it, to be honest, because I usually don't talk about my personal life of anybody. So, I guess if you heard this part of the video, you're one of the few people that knows what's actually going on in my life right now. So, that's, uh, that's awesome. <laughs> All right, well, um, see you later. Stay tuned for the next episode where we come into the draft. So until then, see you later, and thanks for watching.